ICDTV.net Dividend Report is brought to you in part by 1M3 Corporation, IT Solutions for Banking and Finance. Call them at 917-686-3485. I'm John Hanna, and here are the CDTV.net Dividend Report for Monday, August 24, 2009. CDTV.net covers dividend-paying stocks earnings reports, dividend announcements, and company profiles. But first, here's today's CDTV.net top stories. Procter & Gamble Company and Warner Chilcott announced an agreement for the sale of Procter & Gamble's global pharmaceutical business to Warner Chilcott for an upfront cash payment of $3.1 billion. Under the terms of the agreement, Warner Chilcott, a leading specialty pharmaceutical company, will acquire Procter & Gamble's portfolio of branded pharmaceutical products. In addition, the majority of the 2,300 employees working on Procter & Gamble's pharmaceutical business are expected to transfer to Warner Chilcott. The Procter & Gamble company engages in the manufacture and sale of consumer goods worldwide. American Express Company was upgraded by Barclays Capital from equal weight to overweight with a target of $38 per share. Capital One was also upgraded by Barclays Capital from equal weight to overweight with a target price of $50 per share. PNC Bank was downgraded by Bernstein from outperform to market perform. Stryker Corporation was downgraded by Thomas Weisel from overweight to market weight. And now, the dividend report. Minerals Technologies Incorporated declared a regular quarterly dividend of $0.05 cents per share. The dividend is payable on September 17 to shareholders of record on September 2, 2009. Minerals Technologies Incorporated develops, produces, and markets a range of specialty mineral, mineral base, and synthetic mineral products as well as supporting systems and services worldwide. The board of directors of the Empire District Electric Company declared a quarterly dividend of $0.32 cents per share. The dividend is payable on September 15 to holders of record on September 1, 2009. The Empire District Electric Company, together with its subsidiaries, engages in the generation, purchase, transmission, distribution, and sale of electricity in Missouri, Kansas, Oklahoma, and Arkansas. The board of directors of Slumberger Limited declared a quarterly dividend of $0.21 cents per share, payable on October 2 to stockholders of record at the close of business on September 2, 2009. Slumberger is the world's leading supplier of technology, integrated project management, and information solutions to customers working in the oil and gas industry worldwide. The board of directors of Barnes Group Incorporated has declared a quarterly cash dividend of $0.08 cents per share. This is a reduction from the $0.16 cent dividend paid for the last four quarters. The dividend will be payable on September 10 to shareholders of record at the close of business on August 31, 2009. Barnes Group Incorporated is a diversified global manufacturer and logistical services company focused on providing precision component manufacturing and operating service support. The Board of Directors of McKesson Corporation declared a regular quarterly dividend of $0.12 cents per share. The dividend is payable on October 1st to stockholders of record on September 1st, 2009. McKesson Corporation, together with its subsidiaries, provides supply, information, and care management products and services for the healthcare industry. For more information about these dividends and other announcements, go to cdtv.net.